Good day, Trendsy McTrendster. Um, how are you, I guess? You seem pretty cool. And to answer your question of what I think of you, I'm sure you're lovely. But I don't know, you've got this... this strange look to you. Kind of looks like you've covered a cat in glitter and then set it on fire. Which, by the way, is not a complaint. Well, anyway, you are the one who said that you cause these trends to pan out and be in existence. You are the hip maker, the mainstreamer, uh, the bullshitter. But enough about trends, I want to talk about something more economic. To be more specific, money. I have no idea how that's more specific. The economy is money, so, you know. Anyway, the reason I want to talk about money is because of this. I happen to have a relative, I know, shocking, who is, like me, a nerd. And he goes to these nerdy conventions, and to my knowledge, he is, in fact, a Whovian. Now, the reason I bring this up is because, to some people, going to these nerdy conventions is considered a waste of money. Then it got me thinking, what isn't a waste of money? I mean, all hobbies must be a waste of money, right? You don't need your hobbies to survive. I have a CPU cooler up there. I don't need that, but I have it because I like PC parts. And while I do have a use for it, I do plan on using it, I don't need it. And furthermore, I have a guitar over there, which I use on a regular basis but I don't need that. I also have this camera, which I use to make this video with a microphone, which I use to record my audio, but I don't need that. So in saying that, things like food and drink mustn't be a waste of money, right? But if that's the case, why do we have such a huge variety of food? The film The Matrix has a food which kind of looks like sick. This food contains all the nutrients the body needs to survive. So why don't we just eat that and drink water for the rest of our lives? This brings me on to my question. What isn't a waste of money? What do we need? What do we physically need? Because at the end of the day, we don't need our clothes. We don't need a house. And by extension, we don't need a steak or lettuce or barbecue frickin' sauce. Because we're at the stage where this nourishing sick is actually a possibility. So what isn't a waste of money? And on that, I'll see you tomorrow.